right, guys. So let's go back to the Ashikurami techniques we've been working on. Right? They're all sweat based. So there's two types of uh, ankle locks or leg entanglements. You have the op uh, open entanglement and what's this called? Close. So there's two types we use. There's open and closed. In some of them, when you do it, you're inside the guard. In some of them, you are you're going to be outside the guard when you do it. Just to have that in your head. So let's go back to last week. Um, you know, from here we came in here to the basic standard Ashi position. I immobilized the hips, pinching the kneecap, wedging it, and I have the lever here. So from here I begin to dig. I'm digging. I grab. And we always, we're always careful, guys. We never go 100%. We don't even go 50% because I can rip this ACL here, gable grip, just pinching and pulling back nicely. And if I get this and he doesn't tap, I'm going to stop it because it's too dangerous. So tonight we're going to work on the transition from standard ashi to cross ashi. Now, from this position, it's better if I'm controlling both ankles. You have less control now, don't you? Yeah, I'm controlling both. Ankle. So from here, we're going to go to the cross ashi. So I'm going to I'm going to come this way. I'm going to put my hand here to block it. I'm going to pump my hips up, grab this toe, bring it all the way across, and from here, boom! Simple, simple. Let's go back again. You guys don't get that. Slow down again. So standard ashi. I have this, I want to get this foot. This is the key. I want to have this, it's more control. So I want to bring this leg over because the cross ashi, it's a better opportunity. You have more control. The submissions are better. So I'm just kind of come here. Cover this, otherwise he's gonna kick his leg up and out. So so I'm covering the foot. I'm just popping it up. Now I got control, trying to move this foot, Nathan. Try to move this one. It's a lot of control here. Bring it over, let go of this, and we go to the um, reverse heel hook. This position right here. There. And let's go to the other scenario. If I only have the standard ashi and I don't have the control there, what we're gonna do, dig it in here, dig it in here. Grab the toe. Try, try to bend your toe. Oh, was that the right hand? Right there. One more time. So here, I'm digging. Grab the toe. Straighten the toe out. If I want to, I can turn it. If I turn it, look, he has no control. Sit up here. He cannot roll out of this. Yeah, right there. Pretty darn simple right there. Thank you, Rebecca. 